Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome back to another instructional video. And today we're going to be saying the F word a lot. We're going to be talking about the F word. Um, nothing makes me happier than saying the F word. And by the F word, I mean fractions. I'm not sure what you're thinking, but that's all right. Okay, let's get into it. So, you probably heard this word a lot, fractions. And it might be a lot of students get scared about them. Um, even adults, they're scared of this F word called fractions. So, what are those? How does it work? What do they do? Okay. Don't be scared because a fraction is only a part of the whole. So, I'm here to help you. Mm show you that it's not so hard, okay? So fractions mean pieces um, that are equal. So you can think of the word fractions as they just mean pieces. So essentially fractions are just pieces. Pieces that are equal, okay? So when you see the word fractions, you could just know that they're pieces, okay? So don't get scared when you hear the word fractions. They just mean the word pieces. So here I have a delicious egg. Oh, ooh, 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 look at it, look at it. Hold on, wait, let me smell it. Oh yeah, it smells good, okay. So this egg is one whole egg, okay? But I can make this into a fraction, okay? I can cut it and I will have a fraction of it. So let me cut it right now. Bam! And now I have a fraction of it. Okay, so I cut it into how many pieces? One, two. I cut it into a half. So now I have a fraction. All right, so fractions are written like this. So remember I told you, fraction just means pieces that, have a, that are equal of a whole. So pieces of a whole. So how many pieces of this whole do I have? I have one, two. I now have two pieces. So you write them like this. So I have two pieces, and then the number of pieces always goes on the bottom. So you draw a line, and the number of pieces always goes on the bottom, okay? Boom. And how many pieces do I have? One, two. So I have two out of two pieces here. So I have one whole. I have one whole ego still available, as you can see right here. I just cut it into a fraction. I cut it into two pieces, okay? Um, but I'm going to eat one right now. And oh yeah, this is gonna be great. I'm gonna eat one and oh, hold on, let me be I'll be back. Let me go eat this bad boy real quick. Okay. Oh yeah, that's good. Okay, so I ate one and now I just have one piece left. So we would write this fraction as I still have two I had two pieces, right? If I put this together, I had two pieces. I still have I used that. But I ate one. So now I have one of two pieces left, okay? If you, if you can imagine the rest ego that I had right here that I ate. Now I have one out of two pieces. And this is just known as I have just a half. I have one half left. Mmm, delicious. Okay, so I have another ego here. And let's make some more fractions. So let's cut this up. Yeah. Cut it, cut it, bah. cut it, cut it, bah. cut it, cut it. Cut it. But that reminds me, uh, I need to show you something that will make you sound really, really smart, okay? So I told you we need to cut this to make some more fractions, okay? So if we cut this, we can make more fractions. But I want you to sound like a fourth, fifth grader. I want you to sound very smart. And instead of saying the word cut, I want you to say the word partition. Everybody say that with me, go ahead and say partition. So, partition is just a very smart way to say the word cut, okay? So, next time um, you're with your mom, dad, grandma, grandpa, tia, whoever, uh, and you wanna sound real smart, you can be like, um, mom, can you please partition this for me? She'd be like, whoa, get out of here with that smart talk, okay? Oh, you know what that means? Oh, that just means, that means cut. Okay, so you can sound really so smart with your family. And instead of saying the word, can you cut this for me? You can say, can you partition this for me? Whoo, you'll sound really smart. So go ahead and try that next time, okay? So, partition. 
All right, so I partitioned that ego into how many pieces now? Let's take a look and let's see what did I cut this or partition this into. So I cut into one, two, three pieces. So I partitioned it into three equal pieces. Okay, so remember how we write fractions? Let's see here. So you put the line. I have how many pieces? Three that goes on the bottom. Perfect. And right now I still have three out of three pieces. I haven't added any yet. Okay, so I still have one hole. Perfect. But now, as you know, I get to eat another one. It's too bad you can't, okay? Mm, hold on, wait, let me smell it. Oh, yeah, that smells real good. Can you smell that? Oh, too bad you can't. All right, so I'm gonna eat this one. Hold on, I'll be right back. Oh, delicious, delicious, yum. Okay, so I ate that piece and I still have two left, okay? So, but how many pieces did I start with? I started with three, and now I still have one, two left for later or for right now, but I gotta go get some butter first, cause it was a little dry, I'm not gonna lie, I needed some butter. All right, so now I have two out of three pieces, okay? Perfect. So I partitioned this Eggo waffle into three pieces, or we, we call that thirds, okay? So, and that reminds me, I need to show you something. I need to show you the way we talk about fractions, okay? It's almost like a secret language, if you didn't know. Okay, let me move this ego over here. All right. So, you wouldn't say, you wouldn't tell your mom, like, here's this ego. Can you fraction this? Uh, can you have fraction this into two pieces for me? What? You wouldn't say that, okay? You wouldn't say, can you cut this into two fractions for me? Because remember, I said that fractions just mean pieces that are equal, okay? So you wouldn't say, can you cut this into two fractions? You would probably say, can you just cut this uh, in half, right? So we'd say two fractions or two pieces is just half, okay? Or you wouldn't say, can you cut this into three fractions for me? You wouldn't say that, you would say, thirds so three pieces or three because fractions are just pieces that are equal three fractions or thirds okay and same thing for this one you wouldn't say please partition this in four fractions for me you would say fourths cut this into fourths for me so this is half thirds Four pieces. Uh, can you think of what fifth, uh, five fractions might be? I just said it. Fifths. And I'll stop right here. The last one, what would six fractions be? It would equal six. Sixth. Boom. All right, so. Anytime you hear the word halves, thirds, fourths, fifths, or sixths, you know that they're most likely dealing with fractions. And that's kind of what they look like here. So again, you wouldn't say, you wouldn't tell your mom, can you partition this for me into two fractions? No, you would just say half, okay? So that's kind of like the secret language here. Don't forget that. But I know it's going to take some time. So as you practice more and you you... Deal with fractions more, you'll get them no problem. All right, let's do some more examples and then I'm gonna put some on the screen and I want you to tell me which fraction are they. Are you ready? All right, now we're gonna make some more fractions, but this time I got a delicious chocolate bar. Oh, yeah. Let's open this bad boy up and let's start cutting it. Oh, do I got the golden ticket? Nope. All right. All right. So I skipped uh, the little unwrapping for you and I have it right here. Okay. So here is the delicious chocolate bar. Ooh. Oh, oh yeah. It smells good. It smells good. Okay. So let's cut this bad boy up into some fractions. Okay. Um, 
I'm gonna partition this. Um, let's do, let's make, can you, let's make, let's make fourths, okay? I'm gonna partition this chocolate bar into fourths. So the first thing that we need to do, um, well, I like this chocolate bar. It shows us fourths already. So let's cut it first in half, okay? So here's my dusty, dusty knife. Don't try this at home. All right, I'm gonna cut it. Be careful if you cut this. Okay, there's my first cut. So right now, I partition this into which fraction? I'll see here, I have how many pieces? One, two, I have two pieces. So right now, I partition this into half. So I have two pieces, okay? But like I said, I wanted to make fourths. So let's cut it one more time. I'm gonna cut it. Remember, fractions are just pieces that are equal of the whole. So I think if I cut it right here, it'll be, I'll have two even pieces. So let's cut it right here. Now you wanna be careful. Don't try this at home because uh, if you're gonna cut, if you're gonna try this with some chocolate, make sure you ask your family to help you cut it. Cause if not, you might cut yourself like it. I should ask my mom. I, I cut myself. All right, here we go. All right, so I cut my chocolate here and now I have one, two, I have three pieces. But would this could be considered thirds? Hmm, let me see here. Fractions are pieces that are equal. Is this giant piece equal to this one and this one? If you put these together, it is, but right now it is not. So this is not technically thirds, okay? Because this part is bigger than these two. I'm trying to get four or four equal pieces to share with four of my friends, okay? So I have this piece. This looks like a good piece to eat, okay? I have this piece, both even, both fair, okay? So I have to cut it one more time right here to get four equal pieces and cut it into fourths. All right, so let's do that right now. I'm gonna cut it right here. All right, I cut it into four equal pieces now, except I had a little bit of problems when cutting this piece. As you can see, it kind of broke off. I'm just making a huge mess, but that's all right. Okay, so now I have four equal pieces. One, two, three, four, boom. So now I have fourths, which is perfect, and that's what I wanted. I wanted four equal pieces. So right now, I have four pieces, boom, and right now I have four out of four. Perfect, but you already know what's gonna happen. I gotta eat another one because I'm hungry. Woo, after this video, I'm gonna be fat, but that's all right. Okay, uh, let me see here, which one's calling my name? Uh, I think I think this guy right here, this guy is calling my name. So I'm gonna eat this piece and I'll be right back. Oh, so great, okay. So I just ate that piece, and as you can see, I'm still left with three more pieces that I can give to my friends and family. So again, we write fractions like this. The number of pieces goes at the bottom, because remember, we used to have that piece right here, okay? This piece I ate, so I have four pieces, and I still have how many pieces left? One, two, three. So right now I have three out of four pieces. So my fraction is three fourths, pretty cool. Okay, so I have three out of four pieces, three fourths. Okay guys, now I'm gonna give you some examples and I want you to tell me which fractions are these. Are you ready? Okay, so right here, as you can see, I have four little pieces and I'm gonna eat a few and then I want you to tell me which fraction is, it le is left. Are you ready? Okay, let me see here. Let's see here. I need one for me, one for my mom, and one for my sister. All right. So you tell me which fraction is left. Go ahead and do that now. You're, you too. If you said one fourth, you are a boss dipped in sauce. Yes, that is right. We have one out of four pieces left. One fourth. Good job. All right, guys. So. Here's another one, let's see here. This time there's no uh, answer choices, you tell me. So I have three pieces here, and I'm gonna eat one more because I'm getting full, I don't think I can do any more. So I have one more here, I ate one. Which fraction is this, you tell me.
All right, guys, one last example because I think after I eat this ego, I'm probably gonna go throw up. I've ate way too much junk food. Oh, my mom's gonna get mad and spank me. All right, here we go. Last one, let's see here. So I have this ego, and as you can see, I cut it into four equal pieces. Let's see here. I think I'm going to eat, I'm just gonna eat one of these. Okay, so what fraction? is left okay how many pieces out of the total do i have left you tell me